today we are looking at how I made that rolling dustpan sheet using After Effects. This isn't the one they used in the video, but I tried to recreate my own style. It's a compiling shot with tons of useful technique, which I stand in front to make the first shot, where I chose something and switch to the next shot to show how the thing is going with my first footage selected in the timeline create a new object and name it track right click on the video and go to track motion move the point to the hand we are tracking and click track after it's done tracking apply and ok add the sheet to the timeline and cut out your necessary part change the mode to screen and create a circle around the sheet scale it a little bit and link the sheet to the track Enable the 3D and change the X rotation to 61 to match the hand direction. Click the stopwatch on position, scale, Y rotation and X rotation. Begin to adjust the shade curve to follow the hand angle and movement. After done with it, hot click the Z rotation and change it to time times 1000. To make the shade rotate while moving, enable the motion blur and add tint effect to the shade. Change its color to blue and also add the perfect glow effect. Change the glow tessel to 25.5 and boom! Create an adjustment layer and make a rough mask around the shade. Add its distortion and move the layer under the shade. Feather it and link it to the track. For the second shot, enable 3D and motion blur, then scale the shade. Play around Y rotation and adjust the sheet angle. Tap the watch time on position, scale, X rotation and Y rotation. Let's begin to adjust the angle of the shade with its movement. Add tint effect to heat and change color to blue. Add perfect glow effect and play with the glow setting. Hot click on the Z rotation and change it to time times 1000. Highlight all the footage and pre-compose it. Cut out the place you want to slow. Right click on it and go to time stretch. Change the stretch factor to 2000. And that's it for today's episode. Hope you enjoy. If so, don't forget to subscribe for more. And until next time we meet, keep creating epic videos.